Welcome to the 3D printing revolution. This first course in our 3D printing specialization will provide an overview of what 3D printing is and why so many people believe that it will revolutionize our economy. My name is Eric Reinflesch. I'm the John M. Jones Professor of Marketing at the University of Illinois. I'm also the co-founder and executive director of the Illinois Maker Lab, the world's first 3D printing lab in the business school. I built my first 3D printer in 2010, and I've been actively engaged in 3D printing education and research since that time. These experiences have convinced me that 3D printing is a revolutionary technology that will dramatically change our economy by allowing individuals to turn their ideas into objects. Like most people, you probably heard about 3D printing, but I'm not really sure what 3D printing is or why it matters to you. This course will help answer these questions by demonstrating how 3D printers work, show you what type of things they can make, and how you can benefit both as a consumer but also as a creator from this new technology. This short course consists of two modules. In our first module, week one, we'll discuss 3D printing. I think 3D printing is very accessible, very easy to understand how to use, and the best part about it is there's not a lot of prior knowledge that you need because it's additively building the parts. We've seen 3D printing being used differently than maybe we did two years ago. Um, where before it was pure prototyping, um, we're seeing now um, with material science advances, attempts at you know, attacking real large problems. When we looked around uh, and said, what are the critical technologies that we're gonna need to be able to help our clients understand for the future, additive manufacturing, 3D printing was clearly one of them. This module will provide an overview of the 3D printing ecosystem, including its hardware, software, and materials, and provide an actual demonstration of the 3D printing process from start to finish. In our second module, week two, we'll examine the revolution. You're taking something that's really always been very inaccessible, and, and it is accessible. I mean, you know, it's not easy yet, but we can very easily see that it will be easy. And that's a, that's a game changer, because that, that's going to let you build a manufacturing infrastructure that's going to look very, very different than what we have now. Now we're seeing software developers connecting with the manufacturing process and making the software tools. Um, Autodesk is a great example of this. They have their Pier 9 facility and they're working with designers and incorporating that. And we like to think we're doing the same thing with our processes. We share our pilot materials and programs with our community and take that feedback and try to improve to make it ideal for how people really are using this. Right now, most 3D printers print in relatively passive materials. As the technology expands to printing in active materials, uh, materials that conduct electricity, materials that can sense, can move, can compute, can store power. If you can print in, in a dozen base materials simultaneously, the combinations of those materials that you can use to create uh, objects in 3D, the, what we call metamaterials, is, is far greater than just 12. It's, it's a power of 12, and that's, that's uh, uh, the, in the, the exponential nature of this technology. In this course, we'll take a look at 3D printing's revolutionary potential across a variety of industries, including fashion, retailing, and manufacturing, and also take a look at cutting edge developments in 3D printing technology. We'll examine both of these topics using a variety of learning approaches, including readings, video lectures, hands-on exercises, and interviews with a variety of key players in the 3D printing domain from both industry and also academia. By engaging in these various learning activities, you will increase your appreciation for what 3D printing is and how it's going to revolutionize our economy. First, 3D printing is a new, low-cost, desktop technology that can be used by just about anyone. Second, this technology allows us to easily turn our ideas into objects and gives consumers the power to be creators. Third, 3D printing also blurs the divide between the physical and the digital 
and makes it easy to remix and customize physical objects. Fourth, by changing both the roles of consumers and the nature of objects, 3D printing will revolutionize our economy and change the way we live. Finally, this course will provide a firm foundation for the remaining courses in our specialization. And hopefully, will capture interest in learning more about 3D printing by enrolling in these courses. Are you ready to be part of this new and exciting revolution? Great, let's begin.